The Landlock is our compression molded longboard style of surfer. Uh, one of the cool things about the Landlock as well, it is a very big board and accommodates a wide array of sizes. Um, it is also fun and very maneuverable compared to um, some of the smaller boards within the line. You'll notice that the Landlock features a flat tail rocker, um, which does generate a lot of speed for such a big board. That's one of the secrets uh, to this shape. Even though it's a big board, it doesn't feel slow and draggy. The rail of the Landlock, you'll notice our turned up hybrid style of surf rail. Uh, through the center of the board, out through the tip is a more rounded surf inspired rail, a little looser, a little floatier, which then transitions to a much sharper rail at the tail of the board. Uh, the great part about that sharp rail transition, it allows the rider to get a much more responsive feel off the back foot. The base of the board you'll notice is very clean, uh, a slight concave at the tip um, just to allow water flow through the body of the board. We then transition to a three fin design at the tail of the board, uh, providing just enough grip and response, uh, but not being too much to overpower um, the, the board itself. The tail profile of the board you'll notice is a swallowtail with two slight hips off the, the trailer fin. Um, the purpose of that is to allow the board to uh, be a little bit more responsive, moving that pivot point closer to the rear foot, uh, allowing a rider just to generate a little bit more board control um, when they're moving up and down the face of the wave. This board features a molded EVA traction pad. The great part about that molded traction is it is very soft underfoot. Um, it does provide just enough grip. Uh, we do have a slight kick tail, so you can kind of spot your back foot so you don't walk too far off the back of the board. Um, the traction pad does run all the way to the tip of the board, which allows beginner and intermediate riders to kind of move back and forth to figure out where the best location on the board is for them. Um, really what the Landlock was designed for is to be an extremely universal shape, accommodate any body weight, any rider size, um, any boat wave size. It's a great option if you have a direct drive boat that doesn't throw the biggest wave. Uh, the surface area of the board will do a little bit of that work for you. So overall, Landlock, uh, big guy cruiser, uh, maneuverable and perfect for any boat.